Hello everybody, welcome back to Sally's Face. I do want to apologize if I haven't uploaded any videos in a while. I got hit with um, a tooth disease or gum disease. I think it's a tooth disease, but I'm back, I'm better. I'm gonna be getting a root canal done soon. But before that, let's play some games. Alrighty. So in the last part, we figured out who was the murder, well, murderer. But it found out that that chubby guy down there in the corner in the chair, or the, that dude, uh, was actually innocent. So, let's get to, on to episode two. Uh, we'll do, um, it's, it's start. Start new, yeah. Because, because I think I started the cutscene before. Say hi to the camera. Hi. Sal. Sally, where are you? Hello. Yeah. This is me before I had my long hair. Such a beautiful day. The wonder, the wonder, the wonder so far, sweetie. I want to see the doggy, mom. Can you hear it? Why don't you wait until, until your father gets here, okay? You should be here any minute now. But I really want to see it. <laughs> no, no, please. please, please, can I go pet that doggy? All right, so. Give me a sec to get my purse. Then we can go together. Yay! Oh wait, over there by the tree. Which tree? You didn't say which tree. There was a person. There was a person. Um. What? Why? Why is my face bloody? What the duck? A purse, dog collar, a bones of a dog, a human. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Um, hello? Anybody in here? What? Thank you so much for coming to help out with the toilet. Just happened. No problem, Miss Sanders. I'll have to unclog it in no time. Wonderful. Herman normally would have taken care of him, taken care of it himself, but unfortunately, his finger has turned into a banana pe. Ah! <laughs> Ow! Ow! Oh, I can never imagine that. Why? And the street corner is so dangerous. I understand. Thank you so much. Larry, the bathroom's over there. Uh. 
Ew. 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 Why? Ugh. Oh, that reminds me of the time back at Kate back at when I used to work at Casey's. Um, Miss Sanders, can you please explain to me why your toilet ate me? Hi, how you doing? You doing good? Do that. Please help me. What's wrong? The wire. It stopped. So thirsty. Don't worry. I know how to fix this. Please hurry. When my little pony meets mutation. I think I worked too much. That butt though. Leave. Yes, leave. Some fucked up illusion. Look. Wait. Are we in, are we in what's his face's memory? We are because this is from the first part, from the first episode or the first two parts. I can't remember. Hello? Any? Now, closer. Something to show you. And it's no. Episode two. You're still having those nightmares. I haven't had them this bad since right after my mom died. I really think this building, something off about it. Dude, I know you're so dead about it, but I really don't think this place is haunted. Are you sure? I've been here for most of my life and haven't seen any ghosts. But still, are you sure? But the at the 
About what? Say it. Well, we've known each other for a while now. I have to show you something. Oh. Come on. Ready? Where are we going? Okay, first of all, it is dead of winter. Why are you wearing jeans with hole in them? Whoa. How come you never told me about this? This is where I go when I need to be alone. This is my fortress of salutation. Bro. Awesome. You know, honestly, I've never had a treehouse my entire life. Even as a kid, I wanted one. But I could not even get the materials to even build it. This is so cool. I've always wanted a treehouse when I was when I was younger. Yeah, my dad built this for me before he disappeared. There's an image of your dad with your mom. Wait, what? What do you mean disappear? One day he was. One day he was, and everything was okay. What? Okay, so one day he was here and everything was okay. And the next day he was just gone. No note, no nothing. And all of his things were still here. His clothes, his tools, his wallet, his driver's license, everything just disappeared. Why do I get a gut feeling there's something more to the apartment? Damn, I'm sorry, Larry. I know how hard it is. Parents not get along? No, my parents loved each other. I hardly even ever fought or anything. It isn't what it sounds like. My dad didn't leave. Even that's what my mom shoot. I know he wouldn't ever leave us like that. He loved us. I believe you. So what do you think happened? Look, you know, I'm not generally superstitious. But I know you and Chug swear that the apartment are haunted, but I think there's something else. Like what? I've told many people about this, but I know I can trust you, sir. No, you won't judge me. Of course not. What? Is there going to be a cult? The day before he disappeared, I did something I'm not proud of. My parents got some firecrackers that they told me. So... I, so many times, so many times to wait for them. Not to play with them on my own, but I couldn't just read. I lit a few on the back of uh, Mr. Gibson's door window. Killed their pet whack, rabbit. Was it an M80? Oh man, that's rough. Yeah, so I ran to Mr. Gibson and she screamed at me like crazy, as if I need another reason to piss off. That old bag, I felt horrible. So, that poor bunny. Anyways, I was coming down in the elevator. That's when I saw the demon. He reached out and touched me and got this super cold chill down my whole body. I was scared shitless, dude. I thought I was losing my mind. He was gone as quick as I as he came, as as the door opened. He cursed me because of what I did. He cursed me. Everything in my life was fucked after that. My dad disappeared. My mom stopped talking for a while. I had to spend two weeks in two for accidentally killing that rabbit. My bike got stolen. Do you really spend? Do you re wasn't there? Wasn't there supposed to be, like, a court case over that? Like, aren't you supposed to go to court first to get proof that, you know, hey, this kid purposely killed my bunny? It, like... I missed so much school, I had to take summer classes, and then one of the bad thing after the next. Ever since then, horrible things have happened to me or around me. So you think this curse took your dad away? I know how it sounds, but I know it's true. It's all my fault. 
my dad, the rabbit, the sanders, everything. Whoa, well, hold on, man. Hold on. Even there, even there is some kind of curse on you, you can't blame it on yourself. Every bad thing that happened. Not all your fault. Come on. Sometimes life throws us a curveball. Hey, come on. Life threw, threw a curveball at me. Oh, it hit my face. What does this demon look like? It was like nothing I've ever seen before. It was like a moving shadow, all black. And why do I feel like we've seen that? Mystery. But he had a form of a man. And the eyes were the worst part. Deep red eyes that pierced right through you. Holy shit! What? I've seen it too! I've seen your demon! No way, what? I swear, I've seen it in the building, just, just like you described it. I bet it's linked to the other ghosts, too. I don't know, dude. What if we break the curse of yours? How do we do that? Maybe there's some clue around that could help. We could try and find out more about the ghost. See if we can get to the bottom of it. Sure, why not? I've got nothing to lose. So... useful in there. Huh. What is that? I found this weird ear boy cartridge in the lost and found a while ago. I think it's reacted to natural activity. That was one of the last pictures that we took together not long before he disappeared. leather jacket, there's a couple of old concert in pocket. I guess that earlier he gets his taste in music. It's like a nice way to bond. I don't think I've ever watched a concert on TV like that, let alone get it to go live. A bunch of nature and outdoor magazine, like Larry Dad is opposite of my dad. Magazines are all old from six years ago or more. Doesn't look like anything to me. Oh. That's something else in here. Oh. Any kind of weird small box. Like, is it built shut? It's in the box. What's in the box? I have no idea, man. It belonged to my dad. Some kind of puzzle box. I never could figure out how to open it. We need the blood. Something. In fact, there's a piece missing. Oh yeah, you're right. I've noticed that before. You mind if I hold on to this? Ah, go on ahead. Cool. Let me know if you get it open. Of course. Puzzle piece that belonged to dad. It's a missing piece. Okay. Follow Larry. I'm so excited for snow. Hi, camera.
I'm gonna look around and see what else I can It sounds good. I sort of have to stay here and take care of him. Yeah, I noticed that. Well, what let me know of you? Let me... Eh. Well, I noticed that. Well, let me know if there's anything else. I'm starting to remember. Hold up, hold up, hold up. What's my face? Oh, yeah. What are you? What are you up to? Hi, Sally's face. I'm waiting for the snack guy to fill the machine. I can't start my Saturday without chocolate. Go something a little bit healthier, but chocolate's not. That I hear you. I like to start the weekend off with video games and cartoons. That's how I usually start my weekends. Did you see the new Rico's Mission Life episode? Yeah, that was great. I love that show. Me too. Five oh. To 504. Sure, my mom just took her medicine and she'll be passed out for a while. Anyways, I'll be right up. What do you want to show me? Come on. I'm in the bathroom. Okay. Come on. Damn, this fifth. Damn, these fifth. Damn, these fifth four. Because I've seen better days. Megan, are you here? Hello? Why don't you meet my friend Larry? I don't think there's anything here, dude. I'd be afraid. You're pretty shy. No, I haven't been able to get her to come out in a while. Hope she's okay. So you came up here to this moldy bathroom to talk to a dead girl? How did you come up here? I've been able to talk to her a few times. But like I said, she hasn't been out around lately. I'm not crazy, Larry. I'm not crazy. I want to prove this to you. I never said you were crazy, man. As weird as this is, I believe you, okay? You're my best, you're my best bud. And if this helps at all finding this my dad, then I'm all in it for you. I really thought I would be able to talk to her. I had this feeling. Dude. Know who you should talk go talk to? Toad. Toad's the smartest kid that I, smartest kids I know, and he also is into the natural stuff, like you are. But he could help somehow. Toad, really? Huh? I did that. You would believe in that stuff? Not finished. That sentence normal, normal, rational. <laughs> yes. So, okay. Go talk to him and see what I can find out. All right. I'm going to head back downstairs to make sure my mom's all right. Let me know if you find anything. Will do! Go to. Sally's face. Sorry, it took me a minute to answer. I was wrapping up a tutoring session with Ashley. Have you two met? Hey, I'm Ash. Hi, Ash! Oh my god. Must be 
Happy Sally face. I've heard so much about you. I, uh, me? You have? Yeah. Oh, good things, I swear. But I finally got to meet you. Me too. <laughs> Um, I mean, it's nice to meet you as well. Well, I'd love to stay in chat, but I have to get going. Thanks for helping me out today, Toby. No problem, we can work more on algebra next week. Sounds good. I'll see you guys later. Hopefully I'll run into you again soon, so. That'd be awesome. Enjoy your weekend, boys. You too. Alright, so. Seemed a bit anxious. Oh no, shit! Oh yeah, yeah, I'm good, I'm cool. So, what brings you this way? That seems to be nice. Is she a freshman, too? What is she like? Her phone name is Ashley Campbell. She's a freshman like us. And an overall nice person. She has some trouble with math, so I've been tutoring her for the past couple of weeks. In exchange, she occasionally assists me with my part assignment. She sounds like a great friend. Or I suppose so. Don't come here to talk about her. Oh, it's up. <laughs> I see dead people! Can you turn up? You were telling me your story. I think I may be. The expiration of the paranormal. Fix it. Just fix it. Specifically, I have a suspicion that an apartment that's in my... Not really. Because it does seem to be a strange coincidence that you, Megan, you're Megan, and my apartment tenants are both found in the bathroom. Did they die in the bathroom? However, it could be also be that the water pipes acts, act as some sort of duct there for them. No, that's the only system we Spectaculation. Do you have a Gear Boy cartridge with you? No. Perfect. Go check out the bathroom. What do you usually call the plumbing? Does the gear boy always light up when she's near? It does light up every time, usually you start talking to her. Sometimes she comes out, sometimes she doesn't. Okay, go ahead and try something. But we can attempt to come to Hello? Is anyone here with us? We're not gonna hurt you. We're friends. Hello? Is anyone there? Nothing. Nothing is happening. The game isn't lighting up either. Hmm. I have an idea. Let me see that. Then I can modify your gear for you felt better to fix it with actual lights. Well, sounds great. All I need is three things in order to complete the alteration. First, I need some amplified device, reception, second, so you need to boost the electric output. Sounds like an uh, anomaly. Antenna and battery pack. Here, I'll be in my room once you get fine. Battery pack So this is going to be the end of part 3 of Sally's Face. So if you guys like that video, hit that like button, subscribe, and in the next part we're going to try to find the antenna and a battery pack so we can talk to this guest. Okay. Hope you all have a wonderful day, and also I hope you all have a good Thanksgiving.